Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Happy Tuesday. It is Tuesday today, so you made it through Monday. Congratulations. My name is Panique Singleton from connectwithpanique.com. Welcome to this morning's episode of If You Woke Up, You're Winning. Um, if you woke up this morning, you should be excited because you're winning already, right? When you wake up and open your eyes, you're winning. And then when you are able to do anything after that, that's just increase, right? That's just extra. That's just abundance. So you are already winning because you woke up this morning. So congratulations on that. Um, for those of you guys who might be new joining the, the live, I do this every morning, Monday through Friday, um, 6.45 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So, you know, tell a friend, share the video. All right. So let's get started. All right, so this morning's topic is, oh yeah, okay, so this morning's topic is, it's going to be hard anyway. Now, I know some of you guys are like, wait a minute, I, I came for motivation, and she started off telling me it's going to be hard. How does that How does that work? That's not what I'm here for, but you just got to stay with me. Just, just watch where I'm going with this, okay? So, it, it's going to be hard anyway, right? So, let me ask you a question. You know, for those of you, and I don't know exactly what your situation is. I don't know what you're going through. I don't know what you're dealing with. But for those of you who are going through some things financially, you know, it, isn't it hard being broke, right? Isn't it hard not being able to, to pay your bills? Isn't it hard trying to figure out, you know, which bill you can pay and, and which bill you can be late on, you know, because you know this one, if I don't pay it, they're going to charge me a late fee, but this one, they're going to cut my stuff off right? So it's hard to make that decision. Which one am I going to pay? Which one am I not going to pay? Because I, I don't have the money to pay both, right? I mean, isn't it hard when you come home and you don't know if your lights are going to be on? Isn't it hard not knowing, you know, where you're going to get the money to, to eat with, right? That's hard, right? Or for those of you who might be dealing with something in your health, isn't it hard being overweight? You know, isn't it hard when you can't even walk up the flight of stairs without, without breathing hard? Or when you're sitting at your desk, breathing hard i know somebody like that right so it isn't that difficult isn't it hard when you're on 10 different medications because of illness caused by obesity i mean that's that's hard right so so on the other hand though as far as the finances isn't it hard to start a business i mean you don't know what to do right it's hard to try to figure out how to market a, a business it's hard when you tell your friends and family you're going to join a network marketing company and they laugh at you right it's hard trying to figure out which company to join it's, it's difficult when people keep telling you no or, or when you have a goal in your business and you don't reach it, right? I mean, you have a goal to make $200 and you make zero that day. That's hard. That's discouraging. That's difficult, right? Back to the health example, it's hard to start going to the gym. It's hard to give up the foods that, that you love to eat, right? It's hard when you first start going to the gym, you know, you're on a treadmill and you can only go five minutes. That's hard. It's difficult to, to make that shift. So what's my point? My point is... Your current situation is hard, but also changing your current situation is hard. But my question is, if it's going to be hard either way, why not make the change? Because see, when you make the change, it's only going to be hard for a season. When you decide to do something different, it's only going to be hard for a little while, right? I mean, yeah, when you first start in the business, you're, you're going to fall down, but you can get back up and you can start again. You're going to have failures, but those failures are just your steps in learning. So, yeah, it's going to be difficult when you first start out. It's going to be a difficult process, but how many of you guys know in the end, it's going to be worth it, right? It's going to get easier, but when you make the decision to, to just stay the same, it's going to remain hard. So, my question is, would you rather temporary hardship? Or would you rather continuous hardship? Because we've already established that it's going to be hard either way. It's hard in your current situation and it's also hard to change. So what do you do? Right? I mean, it's easy to remain the same technically because you don't have to do anything different. You don't have to take any risk. You don't have to try anything new. But it's hard because you're struggling. It's hard to keep struggling. So why not go ahead and make the change and have a little difficulty for a short time? season you know the other day I, I shared a quote that if you do what's easy your life will be hard but if you do what's hard your life will become easy and that's so true right I mean I know people that have I know people um this one person in particular that's an online marketer you know he took these classes and it was hard trying to figure out how to market online you know how to do his websites how to do capture lead capture pages and all that so that was hard work I mean hours and hours of studying of webinars but now his business is 
automated now he's making money while he sleeps because he learned these things and he set all this stuff up so it was hard at first but now it's easy right now it's easy he doesn't have to do as much and so that's the same thing for you do the hard work now so your life will be easy later right so that's that's my point but why do some of us choose not to do that i mean it's going to be hard either way but some of us choose to to stay in the struggle why don't we choose to make the change because it's not hard enough you know, somebody shared this quote with me and I thought it was so good. And, and she said, when the pain to remain the same becomes greater than the pain to change, that's when you'll change. So my question to you is, is the pain to remain where you are greater than the pain to change? I mean, I know it's hard to change, but is it harder to stay where you are? Because if so, you need to start changing. You know, yesterday I said you need to participate in your own rescue, right? You need to start making those steps. You need to start making some moves. I mean, if you're drowning in the middle of the ocean, you can't wait for somebody to send a plane. You can't wait for somebody to send a, bo a boat. You can't wait for the Coast Guard. You got to start swimming. So when are you going to start swimming? When are you going to try to change your situation? Because I know it's hard now, but are you happy with that? I don't think so. I know, I know. I know it's hard to change. I know it's hard to do something new, but the sooner you do it, the sooner your situation is going to turn around. But the problem is you're just so comfortable where you are. You're comfortable, but you're not comfortable because you don't even know where your next meal is going to come from. You don't even know how you're going to pay your bills. So yeah, it's, it's hard being broke and it's hard to start a business, but which one's harder? Which one is going to bring you more pain in the end? I mean, because I promise you, if you make some changes to change your life, it's just going to get better. It's going to be hard for a season, but the reward is so much greater. But if you continue to stay where you are, I'm going to be honest with you, it's not going to get any better. It's probably just going to get worse. So today, my point is, I want you to I want you to see that. I want you to decide to make a change. But instead of just deciding, I want you to take action because there's some of you guys who you see things going on. and You're like, yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. But you haven't moved. You haven't taken the first step. You're still sitting where you are. <laughs> And nothing's going to change. If nothing changes, nothing changes. So start making some changes today so you can have a better tomorrow. Remember, it's only going to be hard for a season when you decide to make a change. But when you decide to stay where you are, it's not going to get any better. So that's all I have for you guys today. I hope somebody got something out of that message. I hope that, you know, that uh, when it made a light bulb go off and made you decide that, yes, I need to do something different. It's hard where I am. It's going to be hard to change. So it's going to be hard either way. So I might as well make the change. I might as well try to take my life to the next level, right? Might as well. I mean, it's going to be hard either way. Hey, anyway, that's all I have for y'all today. I thank you guys for joining me. Everybody who joined the live. Good morning, Lynn. Good morning, Beverly, Tiffany, Paquita, um, Utoka. Let's see who else we got. Deshae, Precious, Alexia, anybody who joined. Thank you so much for hanging out with me this morning. You know, I love when you guys come and hang out with me in the mornings. If you're catching the replay, thank you for joining as well. If you got something out of this video, please like, comment, and share. Maybe you didn't, but maybe somebody else on your page will when you share the video. So, you know, be a friend, help somebody out, and definitely make a change today. It's not too late. It's your turn. You just got to make the decision to do it, and you got to get out there and do it. But first, you got to get off of Facebook, right, and get out there and be great on purpose today because I know you can do it. I believe in you. You just have to believe in yourself and make the choice to be great. So I want each and every one of you to choose greatness on this Tuesday and make some positive changes. Because I promise you, if you do, it's not going to be hard forever. Just for a season. All right? So y'all get out there, out there and be great. And y'all come back and hang out with me tomorrow morning at 6.45 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Everyone have an awesome and amazing day. I'll see y'all in the morning.